A lazy ghost. You're still hanging out with me, aren't you? Who the fancy and everything? So, lambs have been fed. And I was going to be moving these guys at some stage today, I think, or tomorrow. And they all gathered here, but I'm missing Crystal. Crystal's missing. So I've got to go hunt out where uh, Crystal is if she's stuck somewhere or something. Uh, she could be stuck in a fence somewhere and she's not here. Are you all going to follow me? Looking for Crystal. Got to go find Crystal. Do any of you know where Crystal is? Okay, I'm gonna go look for Crystal. <laughs> the flock are following me across the field as I look for Crystal. I'm gonna go head into the woods over here. Hopefully she's just somewhere being silly with her head stuck in a fence. Are you guys coming to help me look for Crystal? Do you know where she is? Hmm? Where's Crystal? <laughs> There's a branch falling in the storm. Okay. No sign. Everybody's following me. Oh, I think I spotted her. Here she is. She's lying up here, sheltered among the hawthorn. There she is. Have to jump down. Hey, Crystal. How are you? What's up? Huh? What's up? How are you? Everybody's concerned about you. Okay. Yeah, you got fly strike. Okay. Yes, I know, it's very itchy. Fly Strike is a nasty person. Okay. Oh, there we go. Look at that. Those little bastards. Okay. And there they all are. Ah. Uh. The wool, I'm not pulling the wool away from her skin. It's already been pulled away. So, little nasty people. Look at them, those nasty things. Okay, I'm gonna bring you in. Yeah, not fair. See, a lot of that she's already scratched away. Okay. Look at that. And then they lift it away. So they lift the wool away from the skin so that they can get to the skin to eat. And there's a particular smell as well when a sheep gets fly strike. 
So I can do a good bit of this here, but I'm gonna bring her in as well and shear her. Yeah, give you some TLC. Poor girl, it's not nice. Yes, poor sweetie. Yeah, I've gotten rid of a lot of them now. A lot of those nasty little things are gone. So I'll bring you in. Okay. Good girl. Yeah, you knew I was coming to help you. I found you and I'm helping you. Isn't that much better now? That's much better. So many of them are gone now. Just from that little bit of pulling of the wool that they'd, that both she and those nasty larvae had uh, pulled her fleece away. Look at that. Oh, it's so itchy. Does that feel better? Does that feel better? Does that feel better, Crystal? As I scratch you. Yeah. Good girl. Isn't that much better? Isn't that much better? Okay. Most of the flock is here now. They followed me all the way over. Look at Java trotting down the wall. Hey, Java. What you doing? Pop. Okay, and this is where I found you. Yes, you're okay. I will now mind you. Let's go back. Is that done? Have I missed somewhere? Have I missed somewhere? Is there somewhere up here too? Are they up around your neck? Now, just so everybody knows that's watching this video, this is not a bottle-reared lamb. Are you, Crystal? She's called Crystal because she has a crystal on her forehead and she doesn't have the blaze. But she was such a sweetheart, I decided to keep her. Look at that. I think I've gotten most of those nasty little fellas away, but we're gonna give you another shear. We're gonna bring you in. And I have the whole flock here now. <laughs> How are you, Java? You good boy. Okay. How are you there? Oh, you're fine too. Okay, everybody's fine. How are you, your feather? You good girl. No, come on. I want to bring you in. Do you think you will come in with me? Come on, let's go in. Come on. Come on, girls. Go 
one. girls girls <laughs> she's got a bit of a horse chestnut in her fleece come on girls come on good girls come on you've got to come you're the reason everybody's moving in. Come on. Leave her brindle. Hey girls. Now, gotta make sure Crystal's in there. Where's Crystal? Oh, there she is. Come on. Come on. Okay, everybody's here. Hopefully you don't have any. I'll have to check you. She's got some fleece pulling away. She might have the beginnings of it. Okay. On, little boy. Hey, Inca, leave it. The gate's closed. Leave it. Leave it, Inca. Inca, leave it. I need to open the gate. Leave it, Inca. Inca, leave it. No. Okay, Brindle, come back. Good girl. Come on, girls. <laughs> I want to get Crystal in and treated. Come on, girls. <laughs> Woo. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, girls. Come on. 
Leave it. Come on, Crystal. Come on. And the straggler. Okay. Now to separate them out. So a few more suspect yos. And here's Crystal. This is the insecticide or the and then that's that's the cream, my lovely um herbal healing cream. So she's been shorn and treated. I'm gonna so I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten yos up here. Uh I really need to shear sheep. Uh, this is a royal pain. So, anyway, these guys, see she had um, maggots as well. So I've shorn and treated her. The other ones are suspect, but don't have maggots per se. But I'm keeping them up anyway to keep an eye on them, just in case. So, if you go backwards, come on, can you turn? Good girl. Come on. Come on, Crystal. She doesn't have maggots. She looks like she did, but I'm keeping her in anyway. So these guys are going to have to be put in, kept in for five days because I've insecticided them. And uh, I think I'm going to try and do a little bit of shearing every day because this is just getting ridiculous. I've never had fly strike this bad, but then again, most of my sheep are shorn in May. This is the first year this has not happened, and this hot, mild weather is no help at all.